Dan Evans, he's got Morgan Morris with him. And Morris, eighth, gets his first touch. Beats his first man easily. Sets the ball back. And Anscombe, so far this season, is 100% with the boot. And there's no sign of that changing. Stay high, most. Use a nine! Abraham's at first receiver. It's a slippery customer. Okay. Rubiskit as opposed to going for a conservative throw. Yeah, I think it's the, the culture Toby's trying to create here at the Ospreys is that, you know, and Gareth Anscombe's a winner himself, you know, he'll go for that extra yard, he's sort of trait we see in Dan Bigger. You know, and that's where you get your, your biggest reward. His weaknesses in terms of pace and keeps the ball alive to Toy. It's on now for the Sharks. Big charge and run by Wakunu. Wakunu, Ospreys on the back foot. And Dan Evans... Covered in the air, knocked on. Yeah. Sunday, Anscombe. 13 kicks at goal in the URC this season. 13 completions. The Ospreys double their time. Fenter, well in eight. Two Fenters in the back row for the Sharks. Van Furen, the hooker. Using the short side. And Cock is through, and oh. at the last moment, when there were numbers inside him, he went for the grubber kick. The Pina was Reese Webb back ten. That's the question. We'll play on for the time being. Now they're slightly disorganised, so they take the three anyway. And that's it. Well Turned down the penalty, clipped over the drop goal, and the Sharks get the first point of the match. Smith. Anscombe, Predro, first touch of the game, straighten up is what he does, and his straight throw, ghosting through defence is Matt Predro. And it's a dropout from underneath their own posts. Well, underneath, their, it doesn't on their own try yeah, line, on their own isn't it? Yeah. Chamberlain sticks his head up, all the it's time over. in the world, he's got one, he's got two, Sorry, and now it's all level. Most of the game's been played between the, you know, around the halfway line. Smith and the toy hit the deck, and it's Nicky Smith who's penalised. Set! <laughs> we do expect Wim Pivak to name his squad for the Ultimate Internationals imminently. And certainly he'll have an eye on the likes of Jack Morgan. We had a very busy first half, as did this man, Matt Pedro. But he couldn't take that one, and he offers an opportunity to the Sharks to get an early strike on the home side. Chamberlain pushes the kick through, and Andrews gives chase oh. oh, hey, for the second row. Looks for the offload, gives the offload, and that is sublime, sublime from the Sharks. Ward with a try. Chamberlain with a little dab, and then the perfect, perfect soft hands on the big second row. This is all about the bounce, the reach of the big second row, brilliantly offloaded, and the support and angle from Ward was brilliant. Nothing much on, just watch the kick, and it's the bounce. He just takes it in, grasping those long arms, beautiful offload, and what a line that is. Brilliant try, what a way to start the second half. Watch this offload as he goes down, pop it up, Beautiful weighted pass into the belly button, and that's a way to finish it. Oh, slowly but surely, you know, starting to dominate this game. Interesting. Technical play there by the Ospreys to pull him off at that moment. He does, he's looked excited, he's looked dangerous, you know, give, give him half a chance. You know, he's the one you fancy. Chamberlain has orchestrated well, things well for the Sharks. And they've got their tails up. Peanut, Chamberlain, well so crafted. Two against one. And thank you very much, says Manus Pogita. And the Sharks are flying in Swansea. This is quick ball, it goes. Pina just goes, doesn't it? 
Rhys Webb just comes out of the line. There's no more communication. They were short on the left-hand side. So they They've did. got to push up and drift there. They can't go in a spot. Just watch. There we are. Rhys Webb, no communication to his winger. He's got a forward inside of him. No communication. Simple, simple. So that's how important the chase was there by by Volmink, the full-back. Yeah, I loved it last week, Jeff. Dwayne Peel referred to as kick-sprint. So yeah. it's kick and sprint after the ball. Do you last know what's time, happen? this is a second opportunity for this man, Chamberlain. Over. And again, he's more than happy, straight off the boot. And twice now, Gareth Anscombe has taken a restart, gathered by Chamberlain. Well, Rhys Davis is on for Morgan Morris, so there's three locks on the field for the Ospreys. Here they come to Ruben Morgan-Williams. Closest the Ospreys have come to try. He's not in the way. Pina not in the way, according to the referee. Good defence there. Fia. Stay there. Davis is with him. Stay there. Round the corner. Ospreys claim they're there. Referee agrees. He's on the line and you lift it. On the line first. I think it's Gary Thomas, is it? It's Gary Thomas. He's short, is he? And then he's driven over, didn't he? He's yeah, there. Oh, good. Let's go. The referee sees that he eventually gets there. The question is, how did he get there? And what happened to that ball? And the Sharks bossing it in Swansea. And the Sharks get the first victory in the URC.